will try to draw a common tangent to two given circles of equal radius. Radius of the given circles are same. Our ability to draw the draw a common tangent. Okay, so let us uh, take some radius, maybe to lower sides. Okay, so let us draw a circle. Let us repeat the circle, and the same times another circle. I am trying to draw from here in this place. Another. Okay, let us say the first circle with the center of uh, name is O, and the second circle I have given a name say R. Now connect O P. First objective is that you connect. Okay, I can connect it. Fine. Okay, I have connected. Now our objective is to draw the perpendicular at O and at P. Okay, so to draw the perpendicular at O and P, I will use the compass again. I take any radius which is lower than that. Okay, I take a different color. So I am taking black color. Okay, draw an R. Okay, draw the R here. Now, making this uh, the center, then again you draw the R and making this as a center. I think you know how to uh, draw the perpendicular. Okay, now with any different radius. Let's take a different radius here and expand and again from these two points you draw the arm. So this is one part I have drawn and then another one. Now wherever they are intersecting, uh, connect with this intersecting point. Now take the scale, uh, this intersecting point and uh, this uh, point O you connect between them. It is nothing but the perpendicular. Okay, that is what is the perpendicular that I have. Okay, okay you will have to use different tools or the proper tools that I have. So it's almost done. Uh, I will take a different color here to make it easier. So that I have drawn the perpendicular here. This perpendicular is bisect is this line, say somewhere at A. Okay. Similarly, we have to proceed here also. Okay. Let us say I'm bringing it here. Okay. Say you draw an arc here with the same radius I have already drawn. And now what you have to do, you go with the same radius, you go through this, uh, this point, okay, draw another arc on this side. Now, the same side actually you have to do, you come here and now this is twist it. Okay, now you change the diameter, you may increase it or you may reduce it, no problem. Okay, fix it, and now you have to draw another arc uh, from this point and this point. Okay, so I am drawing this arc here, and the other side also I am drawing another arc. Another arc I have drawn here. Okay, now our objective is to connect these two. Okay, so take the scale. Take the scale. So this is basically the I am drawing the perpendicular here. Small mistakes uh, is possible, might be possible that it is uh, maybe is really it is very difficult for whenever you will do it manually, you can easily do it. Okay, so it's fine, almost it's over. So now I am connected. 
Okay, this is the connector. Okay, this connector is uh, cutting this two points. Okay, first of all, this point you give some name here. Uh, let us say I am giving this point name. Okay, where it is bisected the circle, and let us say this point name as key where it is. Now you connect AB. Okay, this AB will nothing but the common tangent. Just connect this. So connect. Okay, so the AB I have connected here. This AB is the common tangent for this. Okay, very simple. 